You're a little bit removed, but I guess you never get removed. So never get tired of the game. What are you thinking of when you think about the game these days? Oh, it's exciting. You know, sometimes I wish I was back playing in it. Especially, you know, the uniforms come out and it, it starts to creep towards that time of year. It gets exciting. First, we won the uniform battle. We they, they represent NASA. Like, come on. Um, <laughs> but uh, yeah, no, I always look forward to the game. It's exciting. Got to go to it last year. First time as an alumni which is a cool experience. I mean, we got a game this week, obviously, so I won't be able to go this year. How many did you play in? Four. And what was your record? Three and one. And that's something you'll never forget, right? Oh, yeah. No, those games are very memorable. Probably the most exciting, boring game I've ever been in. <laughs> it's two triple option teams, you know what I mean? So nothing crazy is happening, but the entire game, you like, it's, it's hard hitting, it's hard nose, you're on your toes the whole game because it's such a big rivalry. When you first get to an academy, how do they prepare you? And is there any way they can prepare you once you actually get there and experience it? You hear all of the hype um, and you think you're prepared for it. But I got into the tunnel my freshman year. I heard the helicopters come over. Uh, that was the year Brandon Jackson had passed away too. So that was a little more around that game, you know what I mean? Um, that experience was... It's something I'll never forget. Like I still, I'm, I'm getting goosebumps right now. I'll talk about it. Like that, that experience in the tunnel was so surreal. You said three and one. Do you take occasion to remind people of that if the circumstance <laughs> arises? Uh, you know, I love to say I won three times. One of my good friends actually uh, went to the Naval Academy. So him and I jaw jack every year. We talk, talk smack back and forth, and uh, we play a, a, you know, a small wager on it. Have a little fun with it, and uh, keep it interesting. Do you buy in that? It means more than just the rivalry. It's, it's an intense rivalry, but you're on the same team. I'm going to keep it real. You don't realize that you're on the same team until, you know, you graduate. <laughs> you know what I mean? Until then, those four years, you guys are bitter rivals. So now I appreciate the fact that I was going against people who made the same commitment as I did. But back then, I'm trying to take the other guy's head off. I don't care who you are, what you do. <laughs> what was your best play in an Army-Navy game? Army-Navy game, best play. My favorite, like, favorite moment or best play that I had? Either one, whatever stands Fa out to you. My favorite moment was the missed field goal my sophomore year in the snow. The snow game in Philly. Oh, I ran down to the end zone and started doing snow angels. I was so ecstatic that game. That was, that was a really cool game. The, the uniforms matched the environment. So that was pretty cool. And was there a moment that you had where, boy, this is going to be hard to live with? Yeah. Because it was in this game. I, uh, yeah. I came off the edge. On a, on a corner blitz and I got cut and just missed the tackle and that one went to the house. <laughs> so that one still hurts a little bit. Was that the snow game also? No, that was in the loss my senior year. So that one stings, but it is what it is. <laughs> if people had a chance to go to this, would you recommend oh, them pretty highly? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've, I, I mean, I've obviously never played in a national championship or a Super Bowl, but I've heard people compare it to that. People who've been in each game, so. Um, I like the experience. I think it's an environment that is kind of unmatched.